Have you ever wondered where electricity, the energy that transformed the modern world, came from? The story of its invention doesn't start in high-tech labs, but stems from the curiosity and keen observations of ancient people noticing seemingly ordinary natural phenomena. Long ago, humans observed a strange effect. Rubbing amber with fur could attract light objects like feathers or paper scraps. This was first recorded by the Greek philosopher Thales, around 600 BCE. The Greeks called amber electron, giving rise to the term electricity. Yet, for over 2,000 years, electricity remained a mystery, a fascinating parlor trick with no clear understanding of its true nature. The first turning point came in the 16th century when English physicist William Gilbert systematically studied this phenomenon. In 1600, he published De Magnete, exploring magnetism and laying the groundwork for the science of electricity. Gilbert was the first to use electricity in a scientific context and invented the versorium, the earliest device to detect objects charged by rubbing. From then on, electricity ceased to be a mystery and became a serious subject of scientific study. The 17th and 18th centuries saw remarkable progress. German scientist Otto von Guericke created the first static electricity generator using a rotating sulfur sphere, allowing humans to produce electricity intentionally for the first time. But the most famous experiment belongs to Benjamin Franklin, one of America's greatest scientists. In 1752, Franklin conducted a daring experiment. He flew a kite during a thunderstorm, attaching a key to the kite string to prove that lightning was electricity. When lightning struck, the key sparked, confirming that lightning and lab-generated electricity were the same phenomenon. Franklin also distinguished between positive and negative charges, setting the stage for future research. In the late 18th century, Italian scientist Alessandro Volta opened a new chapter in electrical science. Through experiments, Volta proved that electricity could be generated from chemical reactions between two different metals in a salt solution. In 1800, he invented the voltaic pile, the first continuous electric current source in history. This breakthrough not only revealed the chemical nature of electricity, but also paved the way for countless practical applications. Another pivotal moment came in 1831 when English scientist Michael Faraday discovered electromagnetic induction. Faraday found that moving a magnet through a copper coil generated an electric current. This seemingly simple principle became the foundation for building electric generators and motors, ushering in an era of large-scale electricity production and its integration into every aspect of life. <laughs>